Alright folks, welcome back to my Minecraft playthrough. Uh, this was the cavern we were exploring before in my public inquiry. Speaking of which, I think I need to properly introduce everything. This is Minecraft. It is developed by a single man, or not so much a single person, but by a group called Mojang. And this is a game where you mine and you craft, of course. Um, the world that you will see in a couple of seconds, right there, all of this, you can't see much because of the render distance. I'll try to fix that now. The world you see right now is uh, craft generated randomly. Every world is unique. And it is, I believe, eight times larger than Earth as we know it. Oh, I'm suffering from some lag. And in this world, during the daytime, you're free to wander and roam and explore and do whatever you like. And at night, um, various minions of the darkness come out. They are skeletons, um, spiders, zombies, and in my opinion the most deadly, and in the opinion of many people, creepers, which um, CNNers call them exploding penises. I suppose that's an apt description. An interesting description, at least. And today, I wanted to actually go and storm what I believe to be a dungeon in my furthest little island back there. And I've been planning to get to this for a while now. I haven't because I'm a bit paranoid and because I have so much stuff with me. Um, so I will be getting rid of as much of this stuff as I possibly can and just make myself prepped for an attack or well yeah I suppose it's an attack on this dungeon and I don't have any feathers but I have a whole bunch of flint I should go killing some chickens because I do need arrows arrows would be wonderful right now um, but I'll do what's necessary and I don't need ladders right now uh, this little thing I expect to be a dungeon I'm really not sure, I apologize, but when I went into that cave, I was attacked by multiple creepers and multiple spiders and multiple skeletons, and they all seem to be pouring out of the same vein. Um, I'm not really sure what to expect. Mm. I've looked around where I thought I saw skeletons coming out, I couldn't find anything. But I mean, it could be a dungeon. It could very well not be a dungeon, which would be a bit upsetting and kind of anticlimactic. It would sort of bother me, but I suppose it should be all right. I don't think I need axes. I'll take one axe along just in case. Um, I probably won't be using swords. I'm on a Mac with a trackpad. It is impossible to engage in sword, fight, sword fights with anything. Oh, I should put these in tools. <clears throat> this is my little hub, my crafting base in Mining Operation Alpha. And perhaps I will actually go and collect some food, or some flour actually, so that I'll be ready for this expedition. I don't think I'll need all this, uh, all this stone, but you never know. So I'll keep that much, and I like to keep everything organized. I apologize for all of this. <clears throat> and oh right, I should probably craft myself a couple picks. 
just in case. I don't expect to be doing any mining down there. I really don't want to be mining while I'm looking for this. That's why I'm getting ready for the bare minimum. Just two pickaxes should be enough. I'm getting rid of everything I don't need or shouldn't need. Those. Oh, I, run out, I ran out of sticks too, I guess. Not to worry. I have a ton of wood upstairs. And during this night, I guess I will be preparing, rather than storming, this actual mini expected dungeon. This should very well be enough. More than enough. There we go. And I don't think I'll need this. It's fairly useless unless you're just wandering outdoors. The clock might be useful. I doubt it. It's not a far shot from my cave to where I'm going. And right now, I'm going to harvest all of this so that I can go prepared with lots of bread. Because right now it's nighttime and I don't want to go piggy hunting because I want to conserve my arrows, so I'll just be making some bread. All right, now I have finished collecting all of the wheat and all of the little seeds that came out of that, and I'm going to get to replanting all of those seeds. All right, and there I have replanted all of the seeds. Some of them are growing back. This was a very smart decision, I think. It's very useful to have all this wheat growing Probably because it's a quick and like easy, very reliable source of food and health. There's no, uh, there's no gamble. There's not a chance that you'll get some wheat, especially if you're growing a lot like this. This plot is nine by seven. You can go nine by nine, so you have four in every direction from the water. See, that's all the water I needed to have all of this grow, and I can have more down here for two blocks. But there was a mistake in planning, so I only have a 9x7 plot. Still, this is all I could possibly need. I have a whole bunch of wheat left over. I felt like I should just run some errands before I left. Here is all the wheat I have. I, not well, like I just said weed. This is all of the wheat I have. Um, it's more than enough. And, uh... Ooh, chickens. I want chickens right now for arrows. There you go. Right from the edge. There you go. Are those chickens. There's a chicken. Oh no. Um. I'm going to go inside and craft some bread just to be completely safe. I don't want to be crafting out here at night, just in case anything were to come up from over there. It's not very well protected. Um, there is a very slim chance that something could crawl over my two by my little two brick wide passage, but anything can happen. And it's time to craft some bread. I don't even think I'll be needing all of this bread, but there's never such a thing as too much bread, know what I'm saying? That should be good. I think that's good enough. I'm going to go put away all of this wheat. I don't need it right now. There shouldn't be any enemies around, enemies around here. I don't hear any. But just to be safe, I'll only depart... Wow, I'm not used to checking the clock for this. I'm only depart when the moon goes down completely. Ooh, creeper. Usually a zombie is jumping around in there just because it's dark. Guess not right now. Alright, so I feel pretty ready for this. And I 
think I have enough arrows. What was that? I think I have enough arrows. I, I'm not sure. One left over. Um, I hope that's enough. Maybe I should just go hunt some more chickens while well, it's night time. No chick. Ah, oh, there's a chick. Hello, cloud. Alright, I yielded four more arrows from my hunt for chickens. Nothing too special. And now that it's becoming daytime, in a few seconds I will head out and go hunting down in this dungeon. Don't know what's going to come out of it. I'm hoping for the best. I can't be sure. But I will see everyone next time. Thank you for watching. Please leave comments below. In the comment section. Uh, tell me what you think of this playthrough. Um, do you like it? Should I stay in this world? Should I stop? Um, what am I doing? I'm open to suggestions. Should I do something else? Uh, should I build something? Mm, well, thank you a lot. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.